back. Well, here's a look outside right now. 51, a little bit on the cool side. Winds calm right now, but wind gusts will pick up, and that's going to make it feel a little bit cooler. Across the rest of the area, you can see pretty chilly. Shreveport only at 41. Alexandria at 49. New Orleans still sitting in the upper 50s at 57. But these temperatures are actually three degrees colder than we were this time yesterday. And expect this number to continue to decline. Temperatures will be much colder today than they were yesterday and well below average. So around 11, we're looking at cloudy skies, 55. But then the clouds begin to break in the afternoon, 58 around 3 p.m. Then mostly clear around 7. But notice our temperatures begin to plummet. 50, then 42 around 11. Clear skies, but 30s are what we're looking at overnight. So it will be chilly, and you definitely want to break out the winter coats tonight and tomorrow night. So the cold front has passed through the area, and that's what has brought us these cooler temperatures. You can see some showers in the picture, but for the most part, we're nice and dry. So right around noon, you see those clouds break. Partly cloudy outside, but you can see those showers in the vicinity. There is a slight chance for isolated showers today, but by 6 p.m., mostly dry with a slim chance for showers on your commute home. Just keep this in mind, but by 9 p.m., we're nice and dry, and we stay that way as we end the night and even throughout tomorrow and Friday, just letting the future cast roll to show you that nothing is in sight. We're staying sunny and we're staying clear. But first, we have to make it through a few chilly days. So today, about a 20% chance for showers. Then notice we stay nice and dry as we end February and begin March. Just a slim chance for showers on Monday and again on Tuesday. But overall, a nice and dry weather pattern. So things to keep in mind, noticeably cooler today than where we were yesterday. And we're almost 10 degrees below where we should be for our highs today. A light frost is possible overnight as our temperatures fall into the 30s. Same thing tomorrow night, but we return to the 60s on Friday and our temperatures continue to rise from that point. So today, 58 is our high. We'll see gradual clearing, but it will be chilly and very windy. Northwest winds at 15 to 20 miles per hour. That's going to bring the feels like temperature down, so it will feel a little bit cooler than what the actual temperature is saying. And the same thing tonight. 34 is the low, but it will feel a little bit cooler with the winds factored in. And again, a light frost is possible. We've partnered with iHeartRadio Baton Rouge to give you your weather on the go. Over the next few days, this is what you can expect. Of course, we're cooler today and even cooler tomorrow, but those overnight lows in the 30s are the main concern. But once we get to Friday, we're back in the 60s, getting closer to our average for this time of year. And even as we end the week, we're warming up. We start off March on a warm note, 72, 75 on Monday, 78 on Tuesday. But notice just a slim chance for precipitation. But once we get through these cooler days, we're off to a much better start. And just remember to check your